for the first question uh, is about lowering the uh, HDB prices, which uh, mm. uh, uh, Hazel has uh, explained. Uh, uh, what is our policy? But when we lower the uh, prices of the new uh, HDB flats, uh, we are also concerned that the uh, uh, that move uh, would affect the prices of the old HDB flats. Okay. So at the same time, for the old HDB flats, we have this uh, 99 year uh, lease decay, pro decay problem. Okay. So what we uh, uh, are proposing actually is a two track uh, solution. Uh, one is uh, we are proposing lowering the uh, prices for the new HDB flats. At the same time, for the old HDB flats, we think the government should honor their tacit promise to the Singaporeans that it is an appreciating asset. So at least make sure the assets does not depreciate and de especially dropping in price rapidly. So as a result of that, if we uh, keep to that promise, then we would want to propose that we give all existing HDB flats one chance of en bloc development paid by the government. So meaning when a HDB flats reaches a certain age, maybe say more than 50 years old, the HDB flat owner will have the right okay, to uh, enjoy one M block development. There'll be one to one HDB flat exchange. So that we, what is what we are proposing. If that is implemented, what it means to the market is that the old HDB prices will be sustained. Okay, it will not fall uh, uh, very dramatically. And that will, uh, uh, shelter or buffer the uh, the impact of lowering the prices for the new flats. Because when you lower the prices for the new flat, it will affect the old flats, right? So, but if we introduce this scheme of allowing one, giving them one and block rights, then it will actually shelter the uh, old flats from the uh, impact of the lowering of the prices for the new flats, okay? At the same time, for the overall economy, this has a lot of implication. Because if we don't do that, the HDB lease decay is actually a time bomb because the whole financial system, the whole market expectation has already factored in the fact that the old HDB flats are also appreciating assets. So if you don't maintain the price, then there will eventually be a collapse and it will drag down our whole property market. And that will be a very serious problem for our macroeconomic management. So that is uh, uh, what we are proposing, and uh, we, when we are in parliament, we are push, we will be pushing the uh, the the government uh, to uh, a big policy in that direction.